Principal Ty Thompson had requested that the school be covered in banners when the kids and students and teachers would be able to come back to school. There have been people from all over the country, the world, um, people that don't know anything about our kids here, just what they see on the news, that have felt a uh, felt empowered to not only send these banners but write personal messages that come from the heart, which really I think means a lot. I first heard about the banners um, through the news. I know that a lot of people wanted to send letters and do different things, um, but I think that what is going to leave the biggest lasting impact for all students to see are the banners. It's really inspiring to know that it's not just our Parkland and Coral Springs and immediate community that's um, reaching out and supporting us, but it's really like a national and global global support that we're getting from everywhere. I think that's really touching to, to so many of us. It was a really great organized event. We met here at North Community Park. They had all of the classes ranging from the first graduating class of 1992 all the way till last year, which was 2017. We all met here. Some people were signing banners, some were catching up with old friends, some were just giving hugs and wiping tears away. When we were ready to walk over to Douglas, we organized ourselves in the order of the classes that we graduated, so 92 being the first. And we walked, we had police escort, which was amazing. They shut down the streets. We walked as a unity parade to the school to show our love and support. When we got there, we were greeted by wonderful staff members from Douglas High School that took the banners and told us in return that they were happy to receive them and to display them around the schools to welcome them back. Well, I wanted to do something to help volunteer. My children go to the school, so I volunteered to help put them up, and it actually was therapeutic for me, too, because it was something that I could get involved in that was out of the whole political arena that's going on right now, and I got to firsthand see the beautiful artwork and, most importantly, read the messages. I've even taken some close-up shots of some of the messages that the words and people have written, and it really warmed my heart to see that and really make, gave me a sense of peace and calm of what uh, kind words were coming from across the world. World. Since I wasn't able to physically be there in Parkland, I wanted to be able to send something to the students that they could see from me and from United, who I made the banner on behalf of. We all came together to mourn the loss of the daughter of a United Airlines pilot. And this is their way that they wanted to show that the United Airlines family is with not only that family, but the entire Douglas family and community. I can imagine that when these students entered back at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas after this catastrophic tragedy, 
walking around the school and seeing all these banners, it has to show them how much love and support that they have from the community as well as the world. When I walk around the freshman building, I see so many supportive banners. Um, schools from all around the country are sending in their beloved support, so it's really nice, especially a place that used to be like so dark is now like suddenly being lit up by all these supportive messages. Walking around school and seeing these banners has been super encouraging. I think for a lot of us, um, it's been really hard to walk around campus and just it's a constant reminder of everything that's happened. Um, and just walking around and reading all these banners has been so encouraging to me, um, just to keep being strong and just to keep going. I think it, it definitely gives them a sense of that the world and the people around them are thinking about them and uh, I hope that many of them stop and read messages. I know I've seen some kids stopping and reading some of the messages so I'm sure that that gives them again a sense of a feeling of community and that the country and the world and people are with them and thinking about them. Seeing everyone sending in banners from all around the country is very encouraging to us students. It's just been a little easier coming back to school seeing that everyone's in with us. The banners that are around the school are not only a message of hope, a message of inspiration, but a message to show that we are all MSD strong.